Hi peeps, I'm going to show you today how I made my partner's birthday present. I wanted to go uh, the long mile uh, for him and basically I created first the background like a tarot kind of card inspired in Art Nouveau for him because I'm a Alphonse Mucha fanboy <laughs> and I wanted to go for that kind of background so first I created the background in Illustrator, color it here. I always do the colorizing in Clips of Your Pain. Gives me more freedom with all the tones and subtones and mixtures than Illustrator, but I keep the lines in Illustrator in itself. Uh, to that, I added roses because digital medias and features and symbols are very important for Art Nouveau. And on top of that, I started creating uh, basically Lilith because I'm in love with the myth of it and my husband as well. I created with a system of horns first to give her raw power as a symbol and a crown because she's an empress of the night, if you may. That this same pattern is the one that's used on the figure in itself, of course with different elements. First the crown and then the horns in the plane. So she's first a queen of power, like making that kind of symbolical meaning. Some feathers to touch the symbol of the divine. The skin of her is going to be cold and bluish because she's not a mortal. And then I went for the eyes. For the eyes, I took care of doing like a double pupil. Still seems very raw, but you're going to see her in a moment, in which I have this red inner shine in the innermost part of a snake kind of uh, retin. A little bit of makeup, shadow and cat eye, but inverse, a black shadow and a very bright red cat eye some almost natural lips because they're bluish but they're red and the inside should be black and darker you know the shadow of occlusion but it's actually bright red the luscious black uh, hair with reddish tones like a red that's so saturated that ends up being black or looking black unless light touches it and for the dress that actually shapes her, I what I did was that I saw and I investigated my husband's sky the day that he was born, the night sky, and basically I made a dress out of it. I did the line work in Illustrator, the, all, the overall design, but doing the Perseus galaxy, that's his favorite galaxy, and all the stars, the stars that are made with white was all done here in Clips Studio Paint and they are done with grey as well. They are done with white are the um, visible constellations the day that he was born. It's his, in the left side he has the constellation for Scorpio, would be his sign. This star is Antares, the alpha star of the um, constellation and goes from the tip of the toes to you know her luscious long neck i put perseus galaxy here as a symbol of how she's a goddess of sexuality but also of creation so a galaxy the heart of a galaxy in there yeah she's a very sexual so her dress even if he has a if it has a lot of cloth it's also quite revealing without being vulgar which is uh, a proper, um, gorgeous and powered female lady empress and a forehead jewel because goddess deserved them for her forehead and also for her cleavage. That's, well, the design was made in straighter and all the coloring was done here in the studio paint. And this would be the full illustration because I wanted her to actually pop 
I made a silhouette for her of bright red so you can clearly define her in the whole play. And I made this for his birthday. And he really liked it, so there's that. <laughs> I hope you guys like it as well. Thank you very much for watching.